Okay, I'm going to create a new repository called T1. Just select that and choose a new README. And here it is. And go to my GitHub desktop and clone that. There it is. Clone it. Let's say yes to that. It's cloning. Okay, the first example I'm going to do is where everything goes fine. So I'm going to, I'm in the wrong place. Let me find the right place. T1. Add a new file. Actually, let me make my branch first. New branch. I'm going to call it F1 for feature 1. Go over here, create a new file. F1, enter, go back, commit. Gonna do C for commit F1. Let's go and do that. Let's go and do a pull request. That's fine. And it should be done soon. Okay, great, that worked. Let's go back here. Let's refresh. I have two branches, that's awesome. Um, I'm going to say yes to the pull request, merge the changes, and delete... no, I'm not going to delete the branch, sorry. Um, I'm going to go and delete it from the desktop, and I'm going to say close to this, and I'm going to say desk delete F1, it's going to say would you like to do both, I'm going to say yes, wait a second because it's not done yet, this didn't go away, and now I'll check for it and it'll be gone. And look, no F1. Awesome. Perfect. Now let me make a new branch. Wait, let me sync it first, because I think the syncing might be the issue. So this way Master's going to have the F1. That's awesome. Let's go to... let's make a F2 branch. And I'm going to go and make a new file. And call it F2. Where's my file? F2 enter. Yep. And I'm now going to commit that, CF2 commit. And I'm going to pull request that also, and we're going to hit yes to that. And it should be almost done. And I'm going to go to GitHub and refresh that. Here's the pull request, I'm going to say yes to that. I'm going to merge it. And now I'm going to delete it from here. This is where things get a little interesting. So I delete it from the, re the uh, remote, and now I go back to the desktop, and I say, I say, let's go and delete that. Now if I do both, it's going to give me an error. Give it a second. Dun, dun, dun. Okay, so it says it says something's wrong. You know, the the repository doesn't exist. And then if I do seems like it didn't... let me try this again. Nope, it doesn't... oh right, because it switched at the master, that's awesome. But see, it's still here, which makes sense, but here we go. And let's just delete local, because that's what's actually accurate. So it seems like it did it. It did not hang out here for a while, switched at the master, but here it is. It's still here. I think it should have said, look, these things are out of sync. This isn't working out. Some kind of heads up, but I mean, I... I I've seen it once where I played around and I was able to delete it, but um, generally it just doesn't work. It switches at the master. I just feel like it should delete it from that without having to go into the command line. So thanks for watching. Um, I'm just curious if that's a bug or whatever. Thank you.